Now we just need to ride a bird. How hard could it be? <laughs> if only we could do that in real life, right? Although I don't think there's any birds that are big enough to necessarily carry me. Where are we going? I mean, I don't know if we should just abandon the entire village. We should try and help them fight. Hey. Eh. Uh oh. Uh oh. That that can't be good. <laughs> um. Okay. Now we're in like land of the bird breeders or something. Rude. <laughs> Dad, look! Jesse brought back a girl with her. Ooh, a new recruit. Time for your old man to become Mr. Smooth. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. I guess we should go, you know, let's go talk to some birds first. Hi there. Hi. Oh. We're sinking through the clouds, so we should probably not go on the clouds. Hi, my name is Vela. What's yours? I am Walt Er. Walter? Walt Er. With an apostrophe. We admire lightness in all things. No extra baggage, no extra letters. I'm Chit. Uh, who are you guys? Who are you guys? We're the preeners, of course. We take care of the nests and keep stuff floating. Super important. Um, how are we floating? How are we floating on these clouds anyway? Volume! No, son. Try again. Jeez, um, okay. Uh, circumference? Area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all about surface area. Pounds per square inch. Um, can you guys help? Can you guys me? help me? I need to get back to sugar bunting right away. You're from sugar bunting? So that's why you smell like frosting. What's the big rush? Stay here and float a while. Well, you see, my village, uh, yeah. I just escaped the Maiden's Feast, and now Chakra's going to eat the town. I just escaped yep. the Maiden's Feast, and now Mog Chathra is going to eat the town. You what? Why would you ever run away from such an honor? Such a joyous occasion. Brainwashed. Hopefully the upcoming ceremonies in Shell Mound go more smoothly. We just had our Maiden's Feast yesterday. It was awesome! I bet you'd say that because you're a was boy. very pleased. Good luck topping that one, <laughs> Smell Mound. Thought maybe we could fight. Well, yeah. I just thought maybe we could fight Mog Chathra instead of feeding it. Oh, that sounds horrible. Why would anyone want to hurt such a noble, endangered creature? Because Poor he's Mog killing Chathra. us. Chathra. Um. Did you say that the next maiden's feast was in Shell Mound? Yes. It's so sad. I mean, they're always trying to compete with us, but. Oh, please. Shell Mound girls smell like old seaweed. Um, how do I get to Shell Mound? How do I get to Shell Mound? Um, follow the stink? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, that wasn't very helpful. Look, I just need to get home right away. We have no way off this cloud because no one wants to leave. Mom says she does, but she doesn't really. Right, Dad? I need to get to Mog Chathra. I need to get to Mog Chathra, quick. Good idea. If you sacrifice yourself to Mog Chathra, that might set things right. He's very picky, though. And you'd have to compete with the other maidens of Shell Mound. Hmm. Let's go back to talking about Mariloft. I knew this magical place would win you over eventually. Um, who's Jesse? Who's Jesse? That big blue oligol you rode in on. Oh, really? I guess I owe her a thank you. Actually, take my advice. Stay away. Why shouldn't Why I talk, shouldn't to, I talk Jesse? to Jesse? Well, one of her eggs went missing when she was out. 
She's totally freaking out. Yes, I don't think the golden egg substitute we put in her nest is fooling her. Poor Jessie. Where did her egg go? It's against the Preener Code to point fingers. But Gus was on cleaning duty. And it wouldn't be the first time that oaf fell through. Shh, son. Remember what Brother Lightbeard said. Lou speaks. Cause leaks. Any idea? Any where idea where I can find Jesse's egg? If Gus really did take it, well, he is a little dense, mentally and physically. <laughs> he probably fell through the clouds and went splat in the forest. It's not very funny. You shouldn't joke about suicide. Can you tell me about Brother Lightbeard? Happy to. Harmony Lightbeard is a brilliant philosopher, spiritualist, and buoyancy instructor. We have followed Brother Lightbeard up to the clouds to learn about his philosophy of lightness. Dad gave him all our money. Quiet, <laughs> chit. Oh, So yeah. he's a cult leader. It's a surprise for Mom's birthday. Don't the birds tend the nests? Well, these birds are not exactly model homemakers. Left to their own devices, they'll lay too many eggs, or get too fat, and then, poof, they'll sink right through the clouds. Don't blow, stay afloat. Well, I'll see you two later. Farewell. Stick to the paths. Stay I on the try. twigs or you'll eat a pig. No freestyling, Chit. Sorry, Pop. <laughs> Let's go this way. Go Hi. Birdie. Looks like something's going on down this ladder. Well, I guess we should go down the ladder then, huh? I want to go up here first. I don't just want to disappear. Cloud shoes. Ah. Careful. Ah. I told you to be careful. It's okay. It's just my whole livelihood is gone, is all. I'm sunk. Um, sorry. Sorry. About what? About your knife. Oh, right. My knife. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, you can't make hats without a knife. Hey, can I ask you about those weird guys down there? Uh, my husband and son. Uh, <laughs> what did they do this time? I don't think those guys down there are working as hard as you are. Oh, I think they are, since I lost my knife. What? You must be very proud. Honey, I'm just trying to survive this phase, honestly. I wish he had just had an affair like most middle-aged men <laughs> instead of dragging us all up here. Oh, damn. I think they're going to hurt somebody with those sticks. Oh, my husband would never do that. Harmony has rules against fighting here. Harmony? Harmony, Harmony Lightbeard? The supposed guru my husband followed up here. Yep, I think leader. he's a nut. But I let my husband have his hobbies. This is a little more than a hobby. Your husband is following a guru? He moved the whole family up here so we could study Harmony Lightbeard's philosophy of lightness. It's a midlife crisis thing. I'm just playing along. You're insane. Is that all of them? Well, there's McGee, my teenager. Off their head in the clouds somewhere. You know what I mean. Okay. Enough about your family. Oh, sorry. Was I going on about them again? So what's your so, name? So what's your name? Carl. Carl? No. Carl. It's Carol, with some of the letters removed for reasons that are too stupid to repeat. You can't make hats without You can't a knife. make hats without a knife? Hats? I make life-saving cloud shoes here. Or I did. Until you came along. Well, that's mean. You make shoes out of clouds? Uh, no, shoes that keep you from sinking into clouds. They spread out your weight. Buoyancy is all about. Wait, I know this. Area. Area? Pounds per square inch. Skinny little feet like yours shoot through clouds like chopsticks through whipped cream. Uh, do you really eat whipped cream with chopsticks? Do you really <laughs> eat whipped cream with chopsticks? Only when I'm feeling sad. What? Why don't you use your teeth? Shoes made of teeth? That's creepy. Well, I'll let you get back to your work. No! Ah, my work! Well, that was an interesting conversation. Um, we could go this way. Yeah, we'll go this way first. 
And then we'll go down the ladders. Damn, that's a lot of- oh crap, that's Hi, a lot of Hi, I'm Mag- hmm, McGee. Hey, what's up? <sighs> nothing. I uh, wouldn't say- What did you say your name was? McGee. It's Maggie, but without the A. My dad's idea. Your dad's insane. Don't you mind that your dad took the A out of your name? Well, yeah, but my dad said, Hey, losing an A is better than losing an I. <laughs> your dad's uh, pretty creepy. Your dad's pretty <laughs> creepy. He wasn't before he joined this cult. Yeah, oh, exactly. Whoops. Did I say that too loud? Your dad's, your in, a dad's cult. in a cult? Yeah, he's in a cult. Uh, he's just taking this light beard worship a little too far. But it's okay. At least it got him out of his line dancing phase. I think line dancing was probably what better. What are you doing exactly? I'm taking care of these eggs. If it weren't for me, they'd uh get dusty or something. <laughs> How do you get to the eggs in the high nests? Oh, because I'm so short, you mean? No, I... Uh... I'm just messing with you. I have a ladder. Can I... Oh, is there any way off the sphere? What kind of bird lays those golden eggs? Hey, is there any way off this cloud? Think I'd be here if there were? We used to have a cool feather vader that went straight down to the forest below. But Harmony took it out. So now you can't leave at all? Why'd they take out the feather That's vader? That's ridiculous. Harmony decided that nobody had any reason to leave. Um, maybe I should Maybe jump. I should just jump. Tried it, no good. Whoopsie birdie guards catch you and bring you back. What Whoopsie you need birds. is a ladder, <laughs> but it would have to be much taller than mine. Um, what kind of bird? Hey, what kind of bird lays those golden eggs? Oh, those? Those are egg substitutes. We make them for the older senile gulls who forget they don't have eggs. Interesting. Why are they made of gold? It's the heaviest stuff we have. We want them to be heavy, so the gulls can't carry them off and lose them. Uh, nice cloud hey, shoes. nice cloud shoes. Duh. My mom made them for me. All the other kids have cool name brand cloud shoes, but I get homemade. Oh, but don't tell her I said that. The shoe thing is all she's got. <laughs> Um, Lightbeard's really serious this about this lightness thing, isn't he? Oh, yeah. People say he only eats feathers. Ick. But it's not true. Good. Because that would be weird. He only licks them. He licks yeah. feathers. Hey, can I borrow your ladder? Mm, okay. Huh. That's awfully small. Hey, short things can surprise you, okay? True. So well, I'll leave you alone. <sighs> Okay. Damn. Let's go have a look. Those don't look like Jesse's. Better leave them alone. Hey, that's my knife. Good thing it didn't land on anybody. Can we go and get it? Can't get up there. Use your ladder. There we go. And then we can give the knife to... The woman. It's my mom's special ceremonial knife. Can we take the ladder again? Sweet. Okay, now I want to find some eggs, right? Those don't look like Jesse's. Better leave them alone. Oh god, we're sinking like super freaking fast. Wait, 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 wait. You birds want to help me kill Mom Chathra? Those don't look like Jessie's. What did- oh crap. What did- what did her eggs look like? I might be able to find them like down here somewhere. Hi. Hi. Can't click on any of that. Well, this is a lot of eggs. Those don't look like Jessie's. Damn it! <laughs> no! I didn't mean to! Those don't look like Jesse's. Better leave them alone. Dude, we're sinking like so much. You know what we might have to do, actually? We might have to give her the knife, get her to make us some cloud shoes, and then get the egg. 
That's what I'm thinking. Are you a friend of Jesse's? Yeah, let's do that. That sounds that sounds like a good plan. There we go. Say, that's some knife. Good balance, nice heft. Ooh, and a blood gutter. No, that's for the filling. The less I know about the knife's history, the better. <laughs> Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, I know, they're big, but you'll grow into them. Trust me, you hit 40 and you're gonna be grateful for a pair of comfortable shoes like that. I don't know about that. I can't get them to stay on my feet. Oh, now we gotta get them to stay on our feet? How do we do that? With feathers? Or something? Ooh, downy. Careful, still got some bird mites on them. Ew. Okay, seriously? Hey, think you could make me some cloud shoes that were more my size? Sure. Come back in three weeks. Three weeks? Three weeks? Four, if someone makes me drop my knife again. Well, I'll let you get back to your work. Watch your step. Hmm. What could I fill the shoes with? What could I fill the shoes with? Looks like something's going on down this ladder. We could take a look down the ladder. Let's see if they have anything first. Any idea where I can find Jesse's egg? If Gus really did... Well, I'll see you... Oh. Okay, let's go down the ladder. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. What the hell? Oh, this is the guy, huh? Right? No. Man, I hope that's not a real bird. What? I don't like the way that one's looking at me. I don't like the way that one's looking at me. Can't click on anything else at the moment. Hello. Hi. Hi. So, uh, how's the view so, up there? So, uh, how's the view up there? I don't know. All I can see is my mother's disappointed face. I really like I her. really like your outfit. Yeah, I liked it too. Not good enough, though, apparently. And on top of that, the shoes were too tight. Did you say something about shoes? Yeah, why? You need some? Take yep. these. I don't need any. I'm Thank gonna you. sit here forever. Woman! What are you doing down here? I'm an offering for the Maiden's Feast. You can't tell? Jeez, it's worse than I thought. Um... I was, at the I was in a Maiden's Feast too. Just today, in fact. Oh, really? You didn't get picked either? Um... Well, no, I got picked, but I put up a fight and got away. You... What? I just figured, why not fight the monster, you know? Yeah, right. You didn't get picked. That's okay. Pull up a swing and sulk with me, sister. Um... Look, yeah. I think it's time we start fighting that monster. You're just going through that anger phase after not getting picked. That was me yesterday. Um. Well, I'll leave you alone. Just like Mark Chathra did. I'm used to it. I don't think I should tell her that her outfit is shabby, right? That seems bad. Now they match. How's it hanging? <laughs> Good one. Should I just say it? I'm saying Kind it. of shabby looking for a maiden's feast. Hey, I can't help the way I look. No, oh. I mean the broken bird cages and feathers. Oh, yeah. Well, that's because the feast is over. Um, feast is over, why you look at that? If the feast is over, what are you doing here? Rub it in, why don't you? I'm still here because I didn't get picked, okay? Yep. Look on the bright side. You didn't That's get what they eaten by a thinking. monster. I'd rather do that than face my family right now. Screw those guys. Who am I kidding? They've probably already jumped off a cloud in shame by now. Need help? A cleaning up? Why bother? Well, it's just kind of a mess down here. So am I. That's why I like it. Look, 
I think it's time we start Seriously, fighting that monster. Different. You're just going to well, now. Okay. Well, I can go find Jessie's egg now, I think. Although I don't know where her egg looks like. At least these shoes match, huh? Wanna give me a lift? No? Oh, I can go down there too. Looks like I should go that direction for more clouds. More clouds, you say? Those don't look like Jessie's. Better leave them alone. Okay. Hi. You a friend of Jessie's? Wanna give me a lift? No? Please place your offering into the bowls of enlightening. What, what do you mean? It's empty. Yes. That is why I said that thing about making an offering. Um, I can offer my shoes. A light offering. Harmony will be pleased. Thanks. Hi, are you? You may call me Fathur. Oh, yes, excuse me, Father. No, Fathur. Like a light, beautiful feather. But lighter. You don't look that Harmony light. Harmony gave me that name. It's quite an honor. Uh, what are you guarding? What are you guarding here? I make sure that Brother Lightbeard's time is not wasted. He's a busy man, you know. So, you're Mr. Lightbeard's heavy? Hey, there's no <laughs> call for personal insults. You guys are insane. Uh, can I go up nowhere? Guess it. I don't suppose there's a big ladder like this that goes down. Huh. The last time I checked, most ladders go both directions. Do you know where Gus Do you know where Gus went? He's got an egg I need. That one is struggling with the concept of lightness. He is yet to give up even a single letter in his name. He's worried people will think his name is Gas. Well, yeah. Can I go up and see Mr. Lightbeard? Silly concept. All are welcome on Brother Lightbeard's cloud after they make an offer. I made an offering. I'll let you get back to work. Keep your head out of the clouds. That's kind of hard seeing as I'm like living in the clouds right now. Of course, my heads are gonna be my heads. I don't have multiple heads. <laughs> that is a big ass ladder. Holy crap. Wow. How the hell am I gonna find an egg though? Um. Hi. Hi. Oh my. A fresh face rises from below. Before you ask, let me answer. Yes, you may live here in Marylock forever. Yeah, that's not what I'm asking. Who are you? I am Harmony Lightbeard, the lifter of clouds. Um... Actually, I just want to get off this cloud. Oh, I understand. You're quite mentally ill, aren't you? What? Have no fear, you've come to the right place. I really, I really, really, really want to get off this cloud. Do you have any idea what would happen if people could just leave Maryloft whenever they felt like it? I could go kill Malchathra? What an offensive idea. No! Everyone would leave? What? No! Mariloft would become lighter? Hmm, hadn't thought of that. But no, people would become unenlightened. Oh yeah, I'm sure so that's right So because I care answer. so much, we have the Whoop Suburdy Network to make escape. I mean, <clears throat> unenlightenment impossible. Well, that's very nice of you. Any idea where Jesse's egg went? Uh, losing objects is a natural step in the path to enlightenment. It's part of who we are in Mariloft. It's in our roots. Do not fear it. Well... Why do you have laces sure, and a big bow well in your cloud? Him. Oh, why, well, you see, I exude such a powerful aura of lightness, it's made these clouds hyperbuoyant. If I didn't lash them together, they'd fly away into the heavens. Why are you up here so high? I'm exactly as high up from Mariloft as Mariloft is from the forest below. To show that we're all equals. I don't get it. That's weird. It'll start to make sense after a few weeks of meditation, my child. I'm sure. Can you help me kill Malchathra? Ah, what a thing to say. Hey, there's an egg. Did you just lay that? No, it fell out of my pile of... I mean, it must have been... 
Pay no attention to that. <laughs> hey, are you done with that golden egg? That's mine. I might need it someday. Uh, I mean, take it away. I need it like a blue jay needs a bowling ball. Oops! Oh, great. Heads up for there! Oh. Thanks for the help. See you later. Be Thanks, light, bro. Child. I I don't think the golden egg is her egg though, which doesn't make any sense. Now give me the frickin' egg. Or for there. Oh well, I'm gonna take this first. <laughs> oh man, this thing is heavy. Good thing I have these cloud shoes on. He's breathing. Better let him sleep. Can we take these back? <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna uh take my offer and back. What do you birds do for fun around here? Hi, birdie. Okay, well, we're gonna go give this to Jesse, I think. I think that's what we're doing. Hey, thanks for saving my life back there. Sorry I said you were part vulture. Uh, I don't think that will fool her. She is a mom, after all. Well, what am I supposed to do? I don't think that will fool her. She is a mom, after all. What am I supposed to do with the golden egg, though? Do I... Looks like there's some sort of small tree at the end of this path. What am I supposed to do? Hey, girl. Yeah, hey, you... Hey, settle down. I'm going to find your missing egg for you, okay? What am I supposed to do with the golden egg, though? Um... You guys want these golden eggs back? No, we like to keep them spread out around Mariloft. Bring too many of those eggs to one location. And well, that's a lot of chick. Wait. No, come on. Wait. Duh, yolk. Pounds per. Pounds per square egg. That's not per even a thing. <laughs> I was gonna correct. say, that's not even a thing. Okay, well, well you guys. I'll see you two later. Don't Farewell. know where I can find Stick the to the paths. So. Let's go this way. I think way. I need to use a ladder to get up there. Well, we have a ladder. Hi. She, she's like, uh, what? <laughs> Sorry, just passing through. What? What are you doing? Get off my cloud, woman! <laughs>